The Centre for Rural Criminology is launching the Australian Farm Crime Survey. It's the first national survey to occur in nearly 20 years. Um, this comes off the back of several large state-based surveys. So we ran one in um, Victoria a couple of years back and more recently New South Wales. And the evidence from those surveys suggests, of course, farm crime is a serious problem. Um, but there's a significant dark figure of crime, and that's especially true across Australia. And what that means is that we know that farm crime is uh, fairly rampant, uh, occurs quite often, but we don't have a clear picture of it, largely because it's very underreported. So this is our attempt to collect that information, collect that data from across Australia. It's information that we need to be able to move the needle, to shift the needle uh, against the crooks to address uh, farm crime. This type of data from New South Wales, for example, was uh, foundational to um, rural crime campaigns targeted at communities to help them address and prevent farm crime. Um, we also drew on the experience of farmers surrounding livestock theft and their implementation of crime prevention measures to evaluate a smart ear tag and to uh, adopt that and uh, explore the extent to which it could help us prevent uh, livestock theft on farms. So the survey is targeting farmers broadly, uh, a variety of uh, types of farms and farming activities, uh, all the way from uh, individuals who this is their primary sort of means of income and business, uh, right through to people who work on farms, uh, as well as hobby farmers. And the survey depends on hearing from farmers. Um, without them, we really have no understanding of farm crime, their experiences, but I think more importantly, how we address this problem. We need to hear it uh, straight from the horse's mouth, really, uh, about what the scope of the problem is uh, and how best to address it.